Are you tired of being overcharged and forced into paying a monthly subscription for your Mac and Windows software? Well, if you are, currently we're having a 50% off discount on all the latest Mac and Windows software, such as AutoCAD, SolidWorks, Photoshop, Microsoft Office, and much more. Our 50% off discount will be ending soon, so be sure to text us, Need Software, to 323-405-1341. That's 323-405-1341. We aim to please, so expect 24-7 technical support, the latest premium software, instant software links delivered to your email, and PayPal Buyer's Protection Guarantee. Yeah, rappers with Red Eiffel, Surplus Army, now I mean God cast, you know what I mean? Um, you know, we got uh we got uh some people we, we did it last year mm-hmm. and it was quite successful. Shout out to people like Saigon, made his way out there. Um And this year, we expect uh, quite a few more celebrities to join us. So that's Saturday, April 23rd, okay. from 10 a.m. to 7 p.m. Now, y'all better be on time. Um, when This is not fucking, you know, CP time. 10 a.m. is 10 a.m. We want to start early so we can get the most out of what we're striving to do. Um. So yeah, come on out, man. Shit for fifty dollars more, you get you get everything. Looks like it's at the same location, Mapokonos. Same location. So uh, yeah, shout out to some of my people that already said they're coming. Fucking Peter Guns, gonna hold you to it. Pete Rock, hold to fucking Saigon will be back. Uh, and we got some other, we got some others that are in the works. Word. So yeah, and it's not just for you know rappers. It's for it's for everybody. It's Men, women, children, you know, it's education, man. This is something that, you know, we definitely need to educate ourselves on, especially the times we live in. Shit, you see out in Ukraine when the shit hit the fan, they started giving weapons to just the regular people, the regular civilians. And a lot of these motherfuckers had to go on YouTube just to learn how to use them motherfuckers. Mm. You don't want the first time for you to be handling a weapon is when you, are, you know, are in combat. You want to be comfortable, you know what I mean? Secure right. in your skills and rather have these skills and not have to use them than to need them and not have them. Okay. Right. Right. So come on out. Get you some training. Trust me. You're going to have a ball. It'll be worth it. Word. So, yeah. Somebody said, did you hear about Cain Velasquez? What happened to Cain Velasquez, sir? Afri origin. Cain Velasquez. You want to look that up, sir? Cain Velasquez, sure. Give mm-hmm. me one moment, sir. All right. Yes, if you have your own toys, you can bring them or you, or you can rent toys. You know, when you get there, it's very affordable. The Cain Velasquez situation. <clears throat> Former UFC heavyweight champion Cain Velasquez denied bail in attempted murder case. Whoa. Wow. 
Okay. Attempted former murder. Attorney. Yeah. Denied bail Monday in his attempted murder case. Oh, man. Judge Judge Shalina Brown of Santa Clara County Superior Court said the, quote, risk is too great to let Velasquez out on bail because of the extreme recklessness of the retired fighter's actions. Oh, okay. Let me see. His next court date is April 12th. Um, it is clear to this court that there is clear and convincing evidence that there is substantial likelihood that release would result in great bodily injury, not just to the name complaining witnesses in this case, but to Santa Clara residents at large, Brown said. Uh, this is the judge speaking. So this they acting like he's going to get out and fuck the whole town up. That's what they saying? Mm. God Brown, damn. Man, Brown said this case involves allegations of extreme recklessness to human life. Yeah, man, That's there you like go, bad man. Leroy, bad Leroy Brown. Mm, mm, mm. Remember that nigga? Yeah. Baddest man in the whole damn town. Let me see. What does this dude do, man? Badder than an old King Kong. Okay, let's let's tell Meaner than a junkyard dog. Let's see what he did, man. Last Wednesday, Velasquez was formally charged with attempted murder and 10 other gun-related charges by Santa, <laughs> by Santa Clara County District Attorney Jeff Rosen. They said he shot a pedo. Uh-oh, did he do a good thing? He is facing, Velasquez is facing 20 or more years of jail time if convicted. He tried okay. to kill a pedophile. Is that what happened? That's what they're saying. Velasquez followed Gulatar's truck in his own vehicle on an 11-mile high-speed chase through the city of San Jose. The pedo Ram molested his daughter over 100 times, Brody. Oh, wow. Wow, man. Jeesh. All right. Say no more, man. Say, say no, no more. more. Thank you. Now we get it. Wow. And they're not giving this guy a medal. Wow. Like, because certain shit, man. I'm sorry, man. Like, certain shit needs to be understood and and pardoned like i feel like i don't give a fuck if somebody rape your daughter and all kind of child molest your little baby or some crazy shit like that and you killed him that should be okay that should be like I, you got you got that and don't you think you're gonna be running around killing anybody else out here that one, you got that one. Mm. Like there should be certain freebies when it comes to shit like that. Well, I don't know. Oh, why the we don't want you to take the law in your own hands. Nah, fuck that. Something like that. Imagine a little six-year-old baby. Mm. All bad. Supposed get, supposed to get that man father of the year, man. What the fuck you talking about, man? Mm -hmm. If that's if that's the circumstances, the fuck are we persecuting this man for? Give him father of the year. Mm. <sighs> Cause that's what the fuck you fucking pieces of shit deserve debt mm. to your blood clot yeah that's all bad man you little motherfuckers that want to fuck with children and all that crazy shit pr be prepared mm. be prepared mm. for the Cain Velasquez's of the world mm. Mm -mm. Mm. we out there Gia. 
Chia, mm, Chia. Mm, mm. Crazy. That's crazy. Yeah. Man, we living in crazy times, man. I feel like that uh, Velasquez story isn't nothing new. You know what I mean? When it comes to um, that situation. I feel like I've heard that story uh, a few, time and time again. You know what I mean? Joe Rogan suggested, they said Joe Rogan suggested that Velasquez should have beat the accused to death with his bare fist. Facts. Why not? Why not? 